Welcome back to Hit Parader's Heavy Metal Meltdown. Now it's time for this week's cover story on one of the surprise hits of 1989. After years of struggle, these four guys finally hit the big time when their debut album recently went double platinum. We wanted to find out the secret of their success, so we went on the road with Winger. My favorite member is uh, Kip. My favorite band member is Reb. I like Reb Beach the best. Um, <laughs> I like Kip the best. This is Kip. Rod. Paul Taylor, tall guy number one. <laughs> Reb Beach, tall, tall guy number two. two. put our album out and we didn't expect it to sell 100,000 copies so the fact that it's selling at all we're all just really happy I mean you know we didn't we didn't uh, set our expectations at, at a quadruple platinum and we're gonna jump off a bridge if it doesn't do it so we've already far surpassed our expectations and now we're just having fun yeah you know? we, don't, every night. we just you know we we write <laughs> our songs to the best of our ability and if people like them then we're lucky the pressure's not on with us because we wrote this album in within a six month period of time and, and writing is the band's forte. That's what we all we all love to do the most. Since my baby I left me, I found a new place to dwell. <laughs> That's okay. Well, I have my Miami Vice trimmer, you know, one of those things that they use in ar in the army when they bring you in and they go just run that across my face and never grows in. My big dream was to be on the cover of a guitar magazine, and I'm on one now. Um, and when I saw it, it was just like, uh-oh, I have to set new goals for myself. And uh, it was a great feeling of achieving, you know, the goal that I had always wanted since I was like 14. It's, it's something that you kind of fantasize about. It's really a dream. This is exactly what I've wanted to do. I've, I've had a lot of fun, and a lot of tours, a lot of bands, but this is it. Let's get 